Pulumi is an infrastructure as code platform that allows you to manage resources in over 160 different cloud and SaaS providers using popular general purpose programming languages like TypeScript, Python, Go, and C Sharp. Pulumi is declarative, meaning that you only need to declare the desired state of your resources, and the Pulumi engine will figure out what needs to be changed and in what order. But Pulumi is more than just infrastructure as code. Pulumi also offers powerful policy as code capabilities. Pulumi policy packs allow you to ensure that your Pulumi resources are secure and in compliance with your organization's policies. Pulumi policy packs are fully configurable and can be run both locally for fast feedback and as part of CI/CD pipelines to ensure that only compliant infrastructure is deployed into your organization's cloud environment. Today, we'll show you how Pulumi policy as code and sneak container scanning can work together to ensure that your container images are secure and up to date. We'll start off with a simple Pulumi infrastructure as code program. Our Pulumi program contains a Docker image resource, which is configured to build during a Pulumi preview operation as well as Pulumi update. The base image in our Docker file is an outdated version of Alpine Linux, which contains critical security vulnerabilities. In a neighboring directory, I can initiate a new Pulumi policy pack that contains sneak container scanning by running the Pulumi policy new command. I can configure my policy to be advisory, which will display detected vulnerabilities as warnings, or mandatory, which will fail my Pulumi program if any vulnerabilities are detected. Let's keep this policy configured as mandatory. I can also configure various parameters like the severity of sneak detected issues to report, and I can enable Docker file scanning for improved remediation suggestions from sneak. I can run my policy pack during the Pulumi preview or update operation by supplying the policy pack option. Now I can see that Sneak has scanned my Docker image resource and will not allow me to continue due to the presence of a critical vulnerability in my base image. I can update my base image to remediate the issue Sneak has found and run my Pulumi command again. Now that my updated Docker image has no critical vulnerabilities, it can be successfully built and pushed to the registry of my choice. Pulumi Cloud customers can enhance their organization's security profile with server-side enforcement of policy packs. With server-side enforcement, security or platform teams can create policy groups consisting of Pulumi stacks and the Pulumi policy packs that should always be run on those stacks. When a Pulumi operation like a preview or update is run on a stack in a policy group, the configured policy packs will be run against the stack. Let's show how this works. First, I publish my policy pack with the Pulumi policy publish command. Next, I open my web browser and go to Policies in the Plumi Cloud Console and create a policy group. Then, I add my policy pack and my stack to my policy group. Note that I can configure my policies enforcement levels and configuration settings. Finally, I run a Plumi command on my stack. Note that I no longer need to include the policy pack flag because I am using server-side enforcement. Pulumi Cloud will automatically download and run the policies that apply to the stack. With the combined power of Sneak, Pulumi Infrastructure as Code, and Pulumi Policy Packs, you can rest assured that your organization's containers and infrastructure are secure, all while using the powerful programming languages your teams already know.